Hello everyone, this is Subhita Gupta, Assistant Professor, KC College of Engineering and Management Studies and Research Department. Today we will see the Java program for Primary Calculator Publication. So, again, this is my Eclipse login. My folder is Basics of Java. Inside the folder, there is a package named Simple. Inside the Simple package, there are some classes. I am creating a new class. The name new okay then class and class name I am giving calculator. I am including main method finish. See the package name is simple. What here simple now class name is calculator because I have given in calculator. Okay, now first of all. Calculator means I want to perform some operation like addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. Okay. So for that, we have to use scanner class. First of all, write scanner statement. Scanner variable I'm taking SC. You can take any variable. New scanner system dot See, the red mark is over scanner because we have not we import the scanner class. Import the scanner. Okay. Fire removes. Now we want uh, two numbers and plus. So just see so. Come on. Okay. Control space. And the first number. number now it's your choice if you want to enter int number float number or double number. the maximum size is double i mean you can you want to enter simply two or you want to enter 2.5 or you want to enter 2.59957 it's your choice so maximum can be data type double you can take int you can take float you can take double so i'm taking maximum that is a variable i'm taking a okay so scanner class is S, but if I SC, so SC dot, the type of input is, I have taken double, so here double should be there, like double, okay? I have taken the maximum size. Mm -hmm. Then I want C so the mark, and I'll write, enter, second number. I'm again taking the type double. That's the maximum size I'm taking. Again, reference of scanner class SC dot the type is double. Just in this way, we have entered two types. Two inputs. Now, what we enter? For calculator, we want to perform some operation. Either plus, minus, multiply, degrees. Okay. So that for that, we want operator. So next, C sub command. Enter the operator. Enter the operator. Which operator? You have to enter either plus, minus, multiply, or division. Okay. I'm taking this. Enter any one of them. Okay. Now. Operator will be simple character, so I'll take variable character. And for operator, I'm taking variable suppose op in it. Okay. And that is again from a scanner class means you are going to uh, enter the operator from keyboard. So again, you have to take the scanner class dot. Okay, now type will be next. Uh its type is next dot character character at zero okay this is the type of character now next is uh you want a uh, means there will be some variable where you will store the result so i'm taking variable c 
end and the type is end. Not end. I'll take double because I have taken everything double. So the result will be definitely double. See. Okay. So that will be result. Okay. Now we have to apply this switch order. And switch on which I want to apply on operator because operator can be plus minus according to that operation we perform. So here will be different cases. So case first case will be plus operator if operator is plus. Okay. And the sign. Then what will we do? Result in C, the C equals to A plus B. C equals to A plus B. Case 1. Then case 2. Uh, then break. Then there is no need to check any other result. Break. Then case minus. Then C equals to A minus B. Then break. Then case multiplier. Then C equals to A multiplier by B. Break. Then base divide and C goes to A by B. Break. Break is used to, I mean, now there is no need to check each and every condition. So if condition is true at this case, then it should be break. No need to check the whole condition. That's why break sign is there. Okay. Then default. I'm just giving one default condition as well. Suppose no no cases match. Then what will happen? Then CISO command. System dot out open internal. That error. Operator is not correct, or you have not entered the correct operator. You have not entered the correct operator. Wait a minute, I'm, uh, I'm just connecting the charger. Okay, so now this is next is okay, this is a default value and a done. Okay, now this is over, switch is over. After switch, what we want, we want the result. Say so. Okay. So here result is in the form of C. No, run this program. Enter first number. Suppose I'm writing five. Enter second number. I'm writing eight. Enter the operator. I have just type plus sign. So five plus eight is thirteen. Okay, hmm. or you can uh, just uh, decorate it like this output, uh, just you don't want to simple, you want first number plus second number than this. So for that, the number one is your double number, the double is, for double sign, you will have to write 0.01x. I mean, just uh, what I am uh, saying, 
suppose you've entered number first five, second eight. So it is like should be shown five plus eight equals to 13. I want output should be displayed like this. So this is the first number that is uh, we have entered double. So for that, I'll write 0 0.01F. Then this is plus sign is your character. Then second number also 0 0.01F, then equal to sign, then your result. Okay, so now see so how to write this. First number, double we have taken, given 0 0.01F. Okay, then plus sign is your character. So character will be with percentile C. Then again, percentile 0.01 f because second number and then we want equal to sign then again next number is double so percentile 0.01 f this is the statement but actually the output is first number is represented by this is the first number 0.01 and double number that is represented by a right then second number is your character so character is represented by op we have given op then 0 0.01 is represented by the second number that is b okay then the output is represented by c okay now what is it's showing Suggestion. Oh. <laughs> It is not directly taking. So it's not working here, so it's fine. So we can just simply, uh, simply we can write a statement. The result of operation is, the result of operation, which operation we can write with plus sign, character. Okay, okay. Then again, in a statement is plus C. Okay. Here, yeah, okay. Plus sign is there. Okay. So the result of operation is this. Now, C. Run this. And the first number and the second number enter the operator that was and up minus so result of operation minus is minus one because six minus seven is minus one. okay so in this way we have done the program of calculation using switch so i hope you have learned it so keep learning keep sharing practice thank you